Counting numbers is a functional kind of meditation. A distraction in the state of isolation, let's make a decision to count to ten together and find a way to weather this hibernation. One, how many days has it been? Have you found a new routine? Have you lost opportunities, new possibilities, new faith in our authorities or still the same old anxieties? How heartened are you by the charity found in our communities? Two, how many are trying to catch our collective breath? Bereft of touch on house party drinking too much. How many are drinking alone, would feel safer alone? How many are on the latest death toll? How many comparative charts do we need to console us? Three. How many expect an impending baby boom? Something to look forward to amongst the gloom? How many Zoom downloads? Jobs furloughed? How many had to look up the meaning of that word? Four. How many businesses with their backs against the wall? Yet how many received that welcome unexpected phone call, a break in the rent, a pre-order, we're in this together, we're all accountable. How many are re-evaluating what's reasonable? Five. How many have discovered creativity, learned the value of art and opened up to their own sensitivity, baked bread to find some normality, yet how many are still privately privileged in this captivity? How much increased capacity on daft.ie due to the decline of Airbnb? How many epiphanies? Six. How many unflinching journalists will be the catalyst to cut through the populist rhetoric? How many idealists, realists, wrap themselves in a flag at a time of distress? How many care workers or those in nursing home care will be redressed? Seven. How many clap for the front line while sharpening knives? How many comply to save lives? How many hospital tears? Slaunch to your health but slaunch to your wealth. How many facing fears? How much politicking is still done with stealth? How many hands washed? Scars are being masked? Sanitizer sought which disaster capital bought? Eight. How many attempted suicides? Heavy hearts, praying to God. A light heart lives longest, mirum cri e drummy fod. How many cherished yet died for this old sod? How many get by with a wink and a nod? Nine. How many aftermaths? New abnormals, fish in Venetian canals. How much collateral damage is within the rationale? How many great mornings and mourning greatly? How many memorials? How many air miles and carbon footprints saved, which implies rescue? They say this is toughened, aren't you? 10. How many leaving certs lost? How much will the college course cost? How many sporting occasions, festival gatherings and built-up emotions need to be unleashed? How many empty streets, full coffins, open calls, closed businesses, quick fixes, slow down stillness in this to what we bore witness? How much hope, resilience, reconnection, comfort and thanks? How many? How much? How hard to quantify? How many collectively counting numbers that are people's names? gives meaning to our lives. How many found reason to notice the seasonal change and the weeping cherry blossom trees blooming? How many were humbled by their beauty as collectively we wait for their petals to scatter and fall all across Ireland and gather on our streets and lonely lanes, a sort of slow washing again of our pains on the living and the dead? How many will find healing when all has been said? One thing the distance has exposed, our hearts need to be close, not closed. I hope that's all right.